Tonight, 13 Investigates continues to fact-check campaign ads. And a brand new ad in the U.S. Senate race has caught the attention of our senior investigative reporter, Bob Siegel. He joins us tonight to explain if you should believe it or not. Todd Young is once again attacking the record of his opponent, Evan Bayh this time on his record involving seniors. Evan Bayh was entrusted with protecting seniors on the Senate Aging Committee, but he skipped 92% of the hearings. The last five years, he didn't attend once. Let's pause right there. Did Bayh really miss all those committee hearings when he served in the Senate? Yes, he did. A Bayh spokesman points out the former senator served on a bunch of committees all at once. So he had to miss some committee hearings to attend other committee hearings. But it's still a dismal attendance record at the aging committee. The claim, it's true, and it gets a green light. But there's more. But when Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton asked him to cut seniors' programs, Evan Bayh was there, voting to cut Medicare for higher Social Security taxes and to hand illegals the same benefits as Americans. That's a lot of accusations, believe it or not. Well, let's take a look one at a time. Did the president and Hillary Clinton ask Senator Bayh to cut senior programs? There's no evidence of that. They did ask him and other lawmakers to vote for the Affordable Care Act, which included a $716 billion cut in Medicare spending. But that huge spending cut did not reduce programs or impact Medicare coverage for seniors at all. It was simply cost savings by cutting payments to hospitals and insurance companies. Bayh did vote for that. And Republicans liked the cost savings so much, they included them in a future budget proposal, a proposal Todd Young helped to write and approve as a member of the House Ways and Means Committee. So Bayh did not vote to cut Medicare. He voted to cut Medicare costs. The claim by Todd Young should be met with caution, yellow light. Now, on Social Security taxes, Evan Bayh's record is mixed. In some situations, he voted to repeal and lower those taxes. In other situations, he voted against that. And what about voting to give Social Security to illegal aliens? Evan Bayh did vote one time to table an amendment that would prohibit illegal aliens from collecting Social Security money that had already been paid into the system. But 13 investigates found when the same legislation came up later, by voted twice to stop illegal immigrants from getting Social Security, helping it to pass in the Senate. The Young campaign doesn't mention that. So looking at the big picture, their claim about Evan Bayh and illegal immigrants gets another yellow light. Overall, this Young campaign ad attacking Evan Bayh's record on senior issues should cause you to slow down. It mixes facts with plenty of misleading statements. Bob Sigler reporting tonight. Thank you very much.